Hi again. Welcome back to the Top Solid Modeling Tutorial. This is step three, where we're going to learn how to create a drilling group. To do this, we're going to start by creating a sketch and constraining some points exactly where we want our new drillings to go. Then we'll show you where to find the drilling group command and how to use it. Okay, welcome back. Now we're going to progress to step three. Again, I'm going to go ahead and pull my PDF document over and have a look. Now, in this case, the drawing is showing me that I have to add two more drillings. If I look at my instructions, it wants me to create a sketch on the top face of the part, and it wants me to create one point each concentric to datums B and D, so that must mean that I want to be at the center of each of these fillets. Cool. And then it looks like I'm putting a 5 8 diameter through hole on each of these, and it wants us to use something called the drilling group to complete the design. Perfect. This will be super simple with Top Solid. Let's have a look. I'm going to begin by selecting my face, right mouse button clicking and choosing Sketch. Using the contextual menus is the fastest way to work inside the Top Solid environment. From here what I want to do is go to the point command and I'm just going to select on my arc here and here. And what you'll notice is the software is smart enough to snap to the center of those for me. This saves a lot of time. After that I can either go to my shape command and go in here to drilling to find drilling group or again to point out these contextual menus and how smart they are if I just right click in space boom there's drilling group now in this case what I want to do is go down to here 5 8 through hole perfect validate and done you've just accomplished step 3 of this solid modeling tutorial again don't forget to save your work